stop whatever you're doing. I wasn't doing anything. I said stop. There's a new patient in the emergency department. Come on, let's but, go. But I... <laughs> Being rushed into Sheffield Children's Hospital is 13-year-old Declan. Looks like he's done something to his leg, Mum. He was training, diving off a three-metre diving board and yeah. he's missed his footing. Declan is a gold medal winning diver. He was at the pool practising his hurdle jump on the three-metre diving board. A hurdle jump? Shouldn't he be practising that at an athletics track, not on a diving board? It's not that sort of hurdle song. It's a type of dive like this. Is that really Declan? Yes, it is. Wow! Declan is amazing. So how did he end up in hospital? Well, as Mum said, Declan lost his footing and slipped. The board hit him in the shin. Bad board. His leg was bruised, grazed and not the right shape. Ouch! Here to take a look at Declan is Dr Rob Cornford. We're going to organise for an X-ray of your leg, find out what the damage is to these bones and then we'll know what we need to do next. All right. Declan is hoping the damage isn't too bad, as he's got a big diving competition in a few weeks. Hopefully I'll be all right by then. Fingers crossed, Declan. Dr Cornford takes a look at Declan's X-ray. What's the diagnosis, Doc? You can see this line here where the brain is broken and you can see that there's some quite sharp fragments which look like they're really pointing out quite a long way out of line from the rest of the bone. This is a really serious break. But the team have a plan. They put his leg in a temporary plaster cast to stop the bones moving and then it's off for a CT scan. This will give a 3D image of his leg to help the doctors decide what to do next. Bottom line, you will need surgery. So with a plan of action, it's off to the ward for Declan to try and get some sleep. We'll catch up with him later to see how the surgery goes. Chris, you'll never guess who's up next. Well, I would imagine it's that it's... Declan with his broken leg. I was about to say that. Let's get to the emergency department. Come on. Earlier, Declan arrived in the emergency department with a broken leg. He slipped and fell during diving practice and the board hit him in the shin, leaving his leg bruised, cut and out of shape. Declan has broken his fibula and tibia. Having stayed in the ward overnight, today Declan is going to have surgery on his leg. Taking the lead will be surgeon Mr John Cashman. Because the bones are broken into lots of pieces, Mr. Cashman is holding them together with an Elizaroff frame outside his leg. Look away if you're squeamish. Gross alert! Mr. Cashman has to drill wires through the bones and then make them tight around a circular ring. The wires will hold Declan's bones securely in position while not damaging his surrounding soft tissue. Stand by for a really gross alert. Wow, that is gross. So, will the frame be off in time for Declan's next big competition, Mr Cashman? It's likely that the frame will be on for at least four months. And it might be up to six. Oh, that's not the news Declan wanted to hear. But he will be able to dive again, won't he? Absolutely. A week later, Declan is already working on keeping the strength and power in his broken leg. How are you feeling? The last week has been a very big stretch for me. I've been doing lots of physio, I've been walking. Declan's even had a message from Olympic bronze medalist, diver Tom Daly. Hi, Dec. I know injury can be like the worst thing ever, but just stick it out. Make sure you're doing everything you can to recover, eat the right things, rest up, and you'll be back before you know it. I will be back. So, no stopping me now. Loving your fighting spirit. Take care now. Bye. Bye.